So we showed participants a profile of a fictional psychologist who either had a tattoo or did not have a tattoo. And if they did have a tattoo, it was either a neutral element tattoo, which was a flower, or a provocative tattoo, which had a skull and some foliage. And they were asked to provide ratings of competence and some of their feelings towards that psychologist. So our main and most surprising finding was that visible tattoos didn't actually have a big impact on whether or not the uh, participants wanted to access services from that psychologist or if they found them um, to be competent at their job. And actually, interestingly, on some of our uh, uh, variables, the participants actually found the psychologists with tattoos to be more competent. Um, so that is really quite different from the literature and the public discourse that says that uh, tattoos are quite damaging to reputations um, or to professionalism and really points to some unsubstantiated stigma related to tattoos in clinical training.